There's quite a big controversy at the moment uh, circling around South Africa. It's about the eligibility of Chidima Vanessa Onwe Adachina as a Miss SA participant. Now, this is important. The 23-year-old law student, born and raised here in Johannesburg, and to the best of our understanding, does have a South African mother. Tebe Ikalafeng, an advocate for brand-led African Renaissance, says she has every right to enter and represent the country in the pageant. She has every right because of being South African. So remember, the focus is not being born. The focus is on her citizenship. She's a South African. Now let's look at this just as an FI. I think 60% of South Africans do not know their, their fathers or, 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 or do not know their fathers or do not live with their fathers. For all we know, their fathers are from Malawi, from Nigeria, from Zimbabwe, and from Mozambique. And those people are moving around this country claiming uh, to be South Africans. She has the same right to that claim because one of her parents or is either born here, naturalized, or has got permanent residency. So she's got the right to represent South Africa, not because she was born here, because she holds a citizenship of South Africa. And that citizenship comes with all the rights and privileges or, uh, that she is, uh, of which one of them is the right to, to take advantage of the opportunities that the country uh, presents and the right to present yourself as a South African. I mean, we had uh, the beast representing South Africa uh, in the spring box. So what, what's the difference with that? Uh, we've had, are you with me? We had the beast uh, in the Springbok who was one of the finest uh, 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 Springbok players, uh, and retired after the, uh, the World Cup, and is South African and claims to be South African. So this young lady, Chidima, has got the same rights and responsibilities.